McElroy. McElroy gets it to the 40 here. And it has never deterred any of them. They're the type that don't shrink from competition, but they, they tend to thrive on it. And there's well, plenty of it. Texas A&M is a, a running offensive team. And uh, running backs like to go to teams that are going to run the football. And so they'll always have a chance to get the better running backs because of their past history. Two wideouts right. Uh, Tony Harrison, top of the screen. Ryan Matthews inside of him. Offset eye on it. Bullet chased by McCoy, gets away, and is knocked out by the lead throw bell about five yards shy of the first down. The Cougar defense has held thanks to the markoffs against the Aggies. And now the Aggies have got to hope for a big return. They've got McPherson back instead of Sherman Smith, who had returned the last two punts. Well, the Cougars have to have something good happen for them. Either they created or let uh, Texas A&M uh, make a bobble. Ooh, J.B. Warren almost got himself a block. McPherson goes nowhere. 38-yard kick by James Bennett, who did a nifty job avoiding a block by John Brown. 8-16 to play. At La Quinta Inns, our most frequent guests are traveling salesmen. So we asked a few how they'd sell La Quinta. You look like a person on the go, am I right? You're a VIP kind of guy, am I right? You don't have time for some fancy smancy breakfast, am I right? At La Quinta, they've customized a free continental breakfast for busy guys like yourself. In fact, this blueberry muffin was baked with you in mind. La Quinta, you're not staying at a hotel, you're staying with us. Selling Houston's best selection of old color Supremes at Sam White's low, no haggle prices. Take one home today. Doing it right at Sam White. Selling Houston's best selection of Isuzu rodeos. Over 100 available with 750 in option savings. Take one home today. Doing it right at Sam White. The best selection of Nissan trucks, King Cabs, and SUV6s with up to 1500 in factory to dealer incentives. Take one home today. We're doing it right at Sam White. Motor City on Beach Nut at the Southwest Freeway. Aggies have 8.16 to finish here before they can improve their mark to 4-1 and one as they head to Waco. And what is always uh, one of the more highly competitive series in the Southwest Conference, our Exxon game of the week next week. 12 noon Central time, and they were leading SMU in the second quarter. Jimmy Kindler steps up and delivers complete to Keith Jack, who is tremendous after the catch. It's 21 yards for Jack with the tackle by Aaron Glenn. They just had trouble getting him out in the clear where he can do his work. Well, I, I feel like he's uh, one of the better receivers I've seen uh, this year, particularly after he catches the ball. He has good running ability. Had some uh, people downfield trying to help him. Watch the other receivers come in trying to uh, make blocks. Also, you'll see the technique used by the Texas A&M secondary. They try to strip that ball any time the man is loose in the secondary. Klingler got it off just as the blitz arrived. Sherman Smith to the 45-yard line. Billy Mitchell, who's had a lot of activity, as the nickel back makes the tackle. Lamar Smith's shoulder injury keeping him out this entire second half. And if that is something that keeps him out more than a week or two, and, and most shoulder injuries can to, and we don't know anything officially, but if it keeps him out for any length of time at all, a struggling Houston attack can really go south. Jack dives, should have a first down to the 48 of A&M with a hit by Michael Hendricks. That's a guy that's been worth 41% of their total yards, Lamar Smith. And that's the thinnest position on the roster to begin with. They only have about three or four in uniform at running back. It'll really hurt them. One of the guys they play at fullback is really a defensive lineman. Bobby Rodriguez, if they put it a blocking back, just because of the shortage of numbers there. Wendler with the audible hangs it up. And way out of bounds, it was intended for 
for Joey Mouton, who got tangled up with Aaron Glenn. I think the uh, Cougar coaching staff made a very good decision at halftime. They came out, stayed really with the knitting that they had planned uh, for this uh, ball game. Uh, they've been able to play good defense and uh, and really keep themselves in this game. They've uh, they've done a good job moving the ball in the third and fourth quarter. Uh, here you see them execute uh, really very shift. solid offensive Offense. plays. Second down. Still close at Rice Stadium. Seven six owls in the second quarter. 27-10 Aggie. 6:44 to play. Jimmy Klingler this afternoon, 11 of 24 for 119 yards. That's about one quarter his output in this game last year. Moffitt gets away from England, but then is caught by Junior White and swarmed under for a loss. They're not going to make a lot of yardage running uh, left, right, east, west uh, against the Aggie defense. Their pursuit is so great that uh, you're just going to have a hard time outrunning them. They've got great speed as well. Moffitt thrown back to his 47. It'll be third 16. Best place to run at the Aggies is straight at him. Four wide outs for Klingler. Going deep. Sherman Smith had a step on Mickens, but the ball was way overthrown. As the wind behind Klingler became his worst enemy on that path. Five fifty-nine to play. Houston will have to punt down seventeen. Low punt. Glenn from his eight-yard line. Going to get the return block set up, and the Cougars cover it pretty well. 44-yard punt and a 10-yard return. Reveille looking on as the Aggies lead 27-10. Elvira here, mistress of the dark and sometimes surfer babe, because Coors Light is the official beer of Halloween and the party's at the beach, Malibu Beach, where you can hang ten, look, Frankie and Annette, and of course, when it's time to chill, just reach for that cooler of Coors Light, aged, ice cold, never frozen stiff, it's the right beer now for Halloween, just look for the Silver Bowl and Smooth Display and dig up your friends now for a party at the beach, happy Halloween, dudes. 17, your order's ready. Number six. It seems as though the creators of Value Meals have forgotten that value isn't just how much you pay, but how much you get. Well, with Whataburger's new Whata Meals, you get Whataburger quality and value with the genuine Whataburger, Whata Chicken, Beef or Chicken Fajita, or Grilled Chicken Sandwich, each served with hot fries and a cold drink, making all other Value Meals seem of very little value. Whataburger Whata Meals at participating restaurants. Breakfast Whata Meals also available. Brought to you by the 1993 Exxon Southwest Conference Supreme Team. Be sure and cast your vote at Exxon through October 31st. By Southwest Airlines. By Nations Bank. By La Quinta Inn. Texas Dodge Dealers. And by Dr. Pepper. And then from their 19-yard line on first and 10, Leland McElroy. Nice off tackle and is off to the races. 81 yards. The freshman 
from Beaumont Central. Just made the run of his life. Wow. Did he turn it on? You know, he's so uh, nifty running in heavy traffic, and then he's got that burst of speed. And the Julius makes it 34 to 10. That is by one yard the longest run by the Aggies this year. Thomas had an 80 yarder, and McElroy bests him by one here. Very simple play a straight handoff with a lead by the fullback. Detron Smith got a good block at the line of scrimmage, but McElroy just drives through and sprints into the end zone. Boy, about the last 60 yards of that, there's no one else even in the picture. Nope. 